Good morning, folks. You're watching the periodic comet Mac Holes. I got a number of messages asking why this didn't appear to be affected by the sun's gravity, why it appears to keep going straight. Well, it's all about our perspective. When we watch the orbit on the JPL, we can see that she swung up from underneath and will exit above and behind us. She's got a normal orbit, folks, just kind of looked strange from where we were sitting. You remember we had a gamma ray burst from Hydra two days ago. Chandra is noticing powerful black hole activity there. This link is below, folks. You can scroll through the many pictures. The drought in the United States is as bad or worse than the heat. I've been reporting on the global changes daily, and while tornadoes aren't unheard of in Poland, this outbreak was horrendous. In South Africa, Johannesburg and Cape Town were completely cut off from one another due to severe winter weather, and again, people dying by the dozens in China due to these storms. It's like something out of a movie. Our magnetosphere has been jacked for about two straight days. Looking at the spikes in the solar wind data resulting from the CME impact generated by that big X-class solar flare days ago, geomagnetic storms should subside today, but they may remain unsettled as we have a lot of settling to do. The red above the blue here indicates solar plasma has been penetrating our ionosphere for over a day. Temporal resonance is strong both at the baseline and at higher frequencies, and the charged particle bombardment remains very high here on Ovation Prime. Goodbye to Active Region 11520, she's going, going, gone. We may get a coronal hole stream from that dark dot turning away from the center, but a much bigger coronal hole is turning in here on the southeast. The moon has moved on from conjoining Jupiter and Venus without acting as a quake trigger. The moon will be aligned with the sun three days from now in a new moon, just as Mars and Uranus are on opposite sides of the Earth. What makes me think this could create an earthquake? Well, besides the work of Big Bites at DC Symbols, here are just a few relevant texts. You'll need to search rare bookstores. Just some food for thought. That's the news, folks. Be safe.